looking, you're looking. What's up guys, welcome back to Hobby Vault. My name is Skylar, let's get right into the video. Uh, I don't know, is it not the most ridiculous play mat? I found it at Dragon Con, I think last year, and it was like this anime, like board game booth, and I was going through the play mats because I play a lot of Paper Magic, and I found this glorious, glorious play mat. It literally, like, she's not necessarily a frame arms girl, but she looks like one, and she looks like Exia, which I found was the perfect segue into what we are gonna be talking about today. Remember my Gunpla Floor video? It's probably one of my favorite videos that I've ever made. But basically, I promised you guys that I would feature my PG Gundam Exia on this channel. And we are going to do a quick unboxing. And it's going to lead directly up to Saturday, October 10th, 8 to 10 p.m. I have to sit here and think about it. 8 to 10 p.m. Eastern Time. I, well, you know what? I want it to go a little bit longer than that, but let's start out with just this little guideline. We are going to give Gunpla Streaming a chance. I am a personal trainer. The pandemic has not been very kind to me, and now it's starting to pick up, and my time is becoming more and more and more and more rare. So what I wanted to do was come up with a way that I can notch out some time in my schedule to be able to regularly make content and hang out with you guys because you guys make everything amazing like awesome like if i did not have gunpla i don't believe i would have been able to keep the little bit of sanity that i have achieved in lockdown because you know what even outside of the pandemic even outside of everything like that gunpla is just one of those amazing hobbies that i have nothing but eternal love for and all i want to do is share it and that's literally the main reason for my channel and i want to help people out so let's try streaming let's try streaming in addition to my regular youtube channel because you guys are just so amazing like i'm growing at a fairly rapid rate and i can't believe it i i grew up a shy little nerd who i still i still i'm pretty shy until i open up so streaming the prospect of streaming is terrifying to me but i just want to hang out with you guys we're gonna get over that hump together and hopefully somewhere along the way we can just help each other out but i also have another little surprise for stream um and what i'm going to do is i'm going to make a video tomorrow that i'm going to release on my youtube let you guys know the actual stipulations of that but i'm excited about that i'm excited about streaming so without further ado let's go ahead and take this pg exia and do a quick unboxing so that you guys will know exactly what we're going to be building and don't worry if you can't make the stream for whatever reason i will be sure to get clips from the stream and make a full-fledged youtube video hopefully i can do it uh, i can't promise you that it will it will actually download seamlessly but i will do my best to get you guys a youtube video so that if you aren't able to make the stream you'll at least be able to see part of this beautiful kit being built but anyways without further ado let's get going look it wait it's bigger than i am like are you kidding me maybe maybe oh gosh <gasps> ah did this help oh no oh oh <laughs> oh no oh no okay yeah this isn't gonna work yeah no this isn't gonna work we're gonna go ahead and move this over to the other table Oh look, it looks like XD is the streamer now. Look at that. Would he be a good streamer? I don't know. I don't think so. Soon it would be either. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna go over the front of the box really, really quick. And then we're gonna go into all of the fun amazingness that is right here. Look at the celestial beings, the LED kit and everything like that. If you guys have built this kit before, let me know, like, what should I be looking out for? What is a problem piece? What, like, what's going on with it? Did you like it? Did you enjoy it? Let me know. But I think this is probably one of my favorite looking boxes that I own. And like <laughs> the detailing on literally every single aspect of it. I usually keep my boxes, so I don't think that I'm gonna waste this at all. I'm definitely gonna be using it for decoration somewhere in this room here because I am just all about the aesthetic of this box here. To the side. Ooh. 
front. You can see the kind of holographic looking there. The Celestial Beings logo. And last but not least, oi, you have the Gundam Exia Celestial Being Mobile Suit Lightning Model Kit PG-160. Yeah! This thing color changes, it goes LED completely through it, much like the MGEX does. I do not have that kit yet. Um, I know that there's a couple of reviews on it right now, but I want to let you guys know that don't feel too bad if you can't afford that unicorn, the MGEX unicorn, because it's basically just remade from a bunch of other unicorns. You can buy a hanger, and the full body LED, you can easily find a way to do it yourself, and it's much more fun, much more cost effective, so don't feel too bad. You can see here we have all of the extra hands and all the weapons. We have all of them. And the biggest thing is that we get the GN drive that's going to be able to light up. I'm super stoked for that part. And then here we go. The full body LED set and everything like that. And yeah. So you know what? Just all in all, a really solid, amazing PG kit. And I'm super excited to get it started. But let's go into the contents here. You know what? I'm going to save this for stream so we can check this out. Actually, ha! Never mind. Hoo-hoo! Electronics and stuff. <laughs> this is going to be fun. I'm looking forward to doing all of this for sure. All of the different, different pieces. This is definitely for our drive. So there's all those. I heard it was a little bit finicky to go ahead and put all these in. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Look at that, so we kind of get a tool to work with it, much like we do on the Mega Size Kits. Uh, that's pretty cool, actually. Then, of course, our battery box and everything like that, and there you go. It's gonna all go in the base. You know what? You would think it'd be a little bit more intimidating that, but honestly, it's not. It's not. Let's move on. There are literally runners everywhere in here. There are a decent amount of runners, and the really crazy part is right here. Woo! Oh my goodness, we have Setsuna right here, right off the bat. And all of, it looks like the GN drive part. Yeah, definitely. The whole entire center unit for the GN drive, you don't know what that is. Ah, I got it. So we're getting our weapons. Woo, oh my gosh. There's clear parts there for the GN drive as well. And then just a bunch of shoulder pieces. This is definitely all of our shoulder pieces. What? Oh, this is definitely for all the base. Check this bad boy out. Our base. You can see where the battery box is gonna go right here. And then all of the electronics are gonna be able to connect to there. And then here is gonna be the part that's actually gonna hold up. Exia, when we get them on that actual base, Ooh, this manual is legit <laughs> a giant freaking book. Oh my gosh. Like, what? Like, it's it's binded. It's pretty awesome. What? Oh my gosh. Look at this artwork on here. Oh, this is going to be a project. I'm quite looking forward to this. What do you guys think? Ah, of course. These are gonna be our clear connector cables that go on the outside of the actual suit here, on his arms, and actually, no, those might be for his legs. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. And our decals, really neat. And then we have the metallic ones as well. You know what, I don't know. Do I wanna paint this? I feel like with PGs, I don't wanna paint them. I wanna leave them exactly as they are. That's what I'll do. I'll leave it exactly as it is, and then later on down the road, we'll probably paint it. But I really, you know what? We're gonna make him exactly as he is because I think he's pretty perfect. Again, we have more weapons pieces here, blades, everything like that, more parts of his drive, his red accents, more red accents gotta tell you this was way 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 more intricate the last pg that i did was the pg endless waltz uh wing and it didn't have near the amount of runners that this has look at these translucent parts here as well the green reflective is always really cool not reflective translucent the green translucent always cool 
Look at this. Oh, I'm so excited. That is absolutely insane. So there's all those. And then we have all of our frame pieces along with some body pieces. Oh, look at that. These are going to be the leg pieces where the actual LED lights are going to come through. And this, this is going to be so freaking cool. So literally, like, just look. It's just stacks and stacks, piles and piles. So that being said, pretty straightforward. What should we start on on this? I know some people are purists and they like to go exactly by the manual, but I am going to give you guys the option of choosing exactly what part we start with. It can be the most annoying part. It can be the part you hate. It can be the part that you have the most fun with. Let me know where we're starting because I want to know where we're starting because I don't follow rules <laughs> when it comes to these. Ooh, oh my gosh, I love the artwork in this. Are you kidding me? This is insane. So yes, that is pretty much it. I know it was super fast. If you want something a little bit more in depth, I'm, you guys can watch it on stream. If you can't make it to the stream, let me know if there's something that you want to see a little bit closer and I will make that video for you guys. But right now I'm super, super stoked to go ahead and do a stream. Don't forget, it's October 10th. It's going to be Eastern time, 8 to 10 p.m. That's what we're starting with trying to go for more. But yes, again, as always, thank you so much for the support. Please stay tuned because tomorrow I'm going to film a video about a quick little surprise that I have that you should be able to enter even if you can't go to my stream. I'm super excited about it. It's just something small. Um, I always want to be able to give back to people when it comes to this hobby. If I could, I swear I would give every single person a kit and I would just, I would, I would, I would in a heartbeat. Yes, if you want to see anything else, let me know. Leave your comments down in the comment section below. Subscribe, check out my other videos. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I appreciate it eternally. So, and I'm super excited that we're finally doing this PG Exia. It has been sitting for a while and it's kind of a shame. And I, I feel so bad and I'm fortunate enough to actually have this kit and have saved my money enough to be able to get it. And if, if you can't get it or it's hard for you to get, maybe maybe this will help a little bit to watch me struggle through it on stream, in video, whatever. But anyways, again, as always, thank you again, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. It'll be very soon. All right. Bye, guys.